the hide on the top side here. Because this is not cut uniform, we're kind of sewing blind. That can be scary. You could catch fringes up underneath. You might be getting it uneven where some of the stitching's here or here. So it's just best to go ahead and turn your side drop over. Grab your fabric tack. Now I showed you here that it didn't catch. We're gonna catch it when we put this um, hide behind this bias. Go ahead and take your fabric tack and do a light line. You don't need too much. We're just gonna hold it in place. This will just make it a whole lot easier and we won't have to keep taking so many breaks in between um, sewing on the hide. So now we take the hide, we start from the bottom because we don't want it to overlap. Taking the hide, go ahead and press it to the side drop. You're gonna have to go ahead and uh, hold it up. Kind of awkward. Turn it over. Go ahead and have it hanging off the edge of the table where the glued side's not hitting, hitting the table. This is not quite positioned right. So this fabric tack is not like super glue where it, you know, it um, seals really fast. You can work with it. Go ahead and press it. So we added the um, fabric tack in a nice um, little layer. We went ahead and squeezed it all the way down. So it's ready to go. Look, it's not gonna fall off. And that makes it perfect for you to be able to sew it through. You don't wanna have to hold onto a lot of things because with your outfit, you know, you want it to look crisp. You don't wanna have to do multiple layers of sewing because it can be hard on your machine. Take your um, needle, position it in the middle of your bias tape row. This is where it's, if you didn't catch in the back, it's gonna catch now. So, make sure the fringes are held up out of the way. And let's go ahead and roll with your, uh, I don't know what that's even called, your wheel on the side to get it rolling. And take your time, don't push, and don't you know force it through, um, but do help it guide through. Making sure all of the fringes are up out of the way, we can go right on through. I wouldn't suggest going too fast, because as you can hear it, it's already going through at least five or six layers here and of hide. Okay, so now we're going ahead and coming up the entire side of the side drop. Pushing it through, we're almost done. Make sure that crease is in. You're gonna wanna do this on each side. Now, we have one side done. Let's go ahead and break the thread. Finished, do this on each side. Thank you from Raven Street Dance Studio.